Do you want to know how you know if you have EDS? Well, ladies, has somebody told you you have beautiful hair, beautiful skin, your hands and elbows can do weird party tricks? You may have EDS. You see, one of the weird laughing things about EDS is you might have garbage town joints, you might break, you might roll your ankles, but y'all have like glowing skin, beautiful hair, and your skin feels buttery. It's lovely. It's, it's, it's quite nice. So you may break, but you have some lovely attributes. And that's one of my dead giveaways when I am working with women, talking to them about the possibility of EDS. Now, technically, I do not diagnose people that have EDS because that needs to come from an MD, a rheumatologist, or a geneticist. However, I like to point patients in the right direction on their journey because when you have EDS, all you know is you. You think you're normal and you are normal, but your hypermobility lends itself to more injuries. If you're an older woman who has significant arthritis, let's say 65 plus, you have like about a zero chance in heck of getting diagnosed because now you're not even gonna have a weird scale because your arthritis makes you look normal now. So I jokingly tell my women who are older with EDS is that you are aging backwards like Benjamin Button. You've already paid all your dues, you've coped with pain, you learned how to deal with things, and your friends as they're aging, now they're getting pain, and you're like, I've done this my whole life, I've got this. So if you have EDS, as you age, you will learn how to cope with pain. Arthritis will stiffen your joints. You're gonna figure this out. But if you are learning about EDS for the first time and you're 65 plus, it is hard to get that diagnosis, um, but it can happen. Hit the plus sign and follow for more Women's Health and Wellness Tips.